Hi guys, welcome back to Piping Welding and DT channel. So this is a simple uh, information, but this is always um, interview in the five feeder. Okay. So first question is how many types of gasket? Okay. So we have number one pull paste gasket so this is asbestos number two spiral wound or metallic so this is spiral wound metallic number three ring type number four metal jacketed number five is inside bolt seeker so this is five types of gasket so please take note all this guys so this is uh, important gasket in the five feeder so next question what are the different types of mating plants or mating plants okay so number one we have flat base number two race space number three rtj so what is rtj so this is a ring type joint okay number four tongue and group and number five uh, male and female okay so this is the different types of mating plunges okay so next question what are the types of bulbs so that one so this is a related uh, questioning by the uh, interviewer okay but simple but if you are not answer you are failed in by Peter so next is what are the types of bulbs so number one is a gate bulb number two globe bulb number three butterfly bulb number four needle bulb number five check bulb number six control bulb number seven knife bulb so this is a few types of bulbs so they have a control bulb okay so many types of bulbs that we have in the five ping so based on function so if you have a question so based on a function what is based on a function so we have a fair based on function so we have number one non-return bulb number two isolation bulb number three regulation bulb and number four this is a special four force bulb okay and next question is we have a two uh types of uh, elbow okay using a uh, basis of using a uh, elbow so we have sr and lr so short radius and long radius so where we where, where uh, this sr and long radius use it using so long radius this is a uh, for a small fracture so long radius using for a small pressure and short radius this is a four high pressure drops okay so next question we have a two types of reducer so a hey, we have a three two types of reducer eccentric reducer and concentric reducer so eccentric reducer using in the pump so this is a pump sanction pump sanction and concentric reducer using for the 
pump discharge okay so that's all for now guys and thanks for watching have a nice day bye bye see you next time and don't forget to subscribe in and leave a comment bye bye hi guys welcome back to piping welding and dt channel okay so this is a layout for this 45 angle iron bracket so we have a dimension here dimension A Dimension B and this is Dimension C. So this is a B equals A and C equals A multiply it to 1.414 Let's say we have this is a 8 and this is 8 so it means this is <coughs> square okay so this 8 multiply it to 1.414 equals the answer is C so this is the answer for dimension C or B multiply it to 1.414 the answer is letter C okay so this is iron bracket so I will show you the the layout of this iron bracket. So this is the design of iron bracket. So from this dimension, this this is sixty seven point five degrees. Okay, and this dimension. This is both 45 degrees. And next dimension. This is also 67.5 degrees. Or 67.5 degrees. And last. This is also. Um. 67.5 degrees okay so this is the layout of how to make iron bracket 45 degrees okay so I will draw a make a line here also
So this is dimension C, dimension A, and dimension B. Okay. So we have one. So we have one ninety degrees to one thirty five degrees equals to forty five degrees of cut and sixty seven point five degrees of cut. Okay, so this is how to make of iron bracket. So So this is it. So thanks for watching guys and have a nice day. Bye bye. Hi guys, welcome back to Piping Welding and DT channel. So this is an example of us building. So I will show you how to as built isometric drawing okay so we have an isometric here and there are different orientation of course and you see this cloud so this is a cloud so it means they have changing of and isometric so there are new isometric they are uh, uh, changing orientation or additional joint additional supports okay they have a um, something like that so this is an example of us built-in or us built drawing okay during line checking, okay. During line checking, if you are line che line check in this site, okay, of course in the check site, and if you see there are some additional uh, additional joint, they have no here in the isometric drawing. Just put the ray machine in isometric drawing, and then uh, if you see course they are changing orientation just draw temporary here using pencil okay and during line checking you see they have um, additional uh, additional supports of course additional Fittings because there are some uh, additional fittings, they have uh, some hindrance or support that coming up from this orientation based on isometric drawing. So, this is the example of as built. So this cloud, this line is an old drawing. It means during line checking, you see this orientation. So this is in the side, this is the orientation. And this on the isometric, this is the orientation. So this is the old and new orientation. Okay. So, if you see this old orientation based on north thing, so now the north is going here based on this isometric drawing. So, this is going to north, down, going to south, going to east, going to south, and down, going to south, and down. So, in that, in the field, in the field so this is the new orientation okay from starting here so from starting here so this is the new drawing 
course this is we will start here okay so from this cloud so this is um, going to north and of course this is going to north you see this um, all the orientation they have no going to west so this is going to west so of course all joint here in the old the, all the orientation of all joint they are also changing the joint number okay so we will start here so it, this is a joint uh, this is a joint 23 okay and they have on this drawing they have um, 23A okay they have a 22 this is a 43 43A this is a new joint 44A new joint 45A 46A so they have a too much additional joints and of course of course additional fittings 46A, so this is a new joint. 35, 34, this is uh, old joint. All that they have additional letter A. So this is a 41A, 42A, so it means this is additional joint. They are uh, additional fittings, changing orientation. Okay. And then after, uh, after you make a drawing based on a uh, field, based on the field you must put a note here some so this is the note just put the remarks in this ISO and put the additional joint as built by if you are an inspector just put your name and of course your um, signature and then put additional joint 42A, 43 something like that additional uh, support 901A, 902A so that is the way how to as build and then go to engineering and then signature and receive by engineering and for, for construction okay so this is if the inspector and also the engineering receive it and signature it receive and forward it to construction this is the new drawing and new revision drawing okay so that's all for now guys and thanks for watching so this is the way how to ask building i saw metric drawing and bye bye have a nice day see you guys